The Giants have allowed a top seven kicker in all but one of their last eight games. They've also allowed two top two kickers four times since week four. And here's the kicker. Santos is almost guaranteed to be a free agent in your league right now. Lamar Jackson comes in at number four. If he's pushed into a starting role this week, I wouldn't be surprised if he ran all over the Bengals. Their defense has been terrible against the run this season, so more of a quarterback like Jackson is sure to give them fits. If given the opportunity, I wouldn't be shocked if Jackson has a big stat line. Coming in at number three is Vance McDonald. He's played on 54% of the snaps since week six, during which time he's averaged 5.3 targets per game. The Jaguars have given up the most points since week seven, and their defense allowed four touchdowns to the tight end duo of Eric Ebron and Mo Ali Cox just last week. Speaking of the Jags, D.D. Westbrook comes in at number two. He leads the team in targets per game over the last three weeks and is running 93% of his routes out of the slot. That's good news against a Steelers pass defense that's allowed the fifth most yards and the third most fantasy points to slot men this season. And coming in at number one is Christian Kirk. He's seen six or more targets in each of his last four games, and the rookie has scored double digits four times in his last seven. The Raiders have allowed the eighth most touchdowns to receivers overall and the ninth most fantasy points to wide receivers on the road, so Captain Kirk should beam you up to a win.